Hey everybody, John Holly here. I just bought a car generator from John Slew, and the reason I did is because I was using a gasoline generator, which is messy and sloppy and smelly, and I found out that in traveling around the country since April of this year, and now it's the middle of September, that I never used the generator. However, I didn't use it also because it's heavy and clunky. And the reason, so when John showed me this, this is the car generator, and it's a thousand watt model. It's very easy to hook up. He showed me the whole thing. It's so lightweight, it's like, what, 11 pounds, John? Yeah, it is 12, 12 pounds, super it's so easy. easy hook it on the front of the car it has a strap to adjust it here and then I got the quick release so this is connected directly to my batteries in the truck which I have two and this will come apart very easily and uh, this stays in the truck so if I have any trouble or anything I could just pull it right out and I hook up the cord directly from the unit now let me walk you around a little bit and this also you can shut you can shut the lid and then uh, the, oh, yeah, the just just down to the first click. You don't want to shut it down yep. all the way. Yeah, it's the first but, click. So you leave ex no exposure right there for the wires. Yeah. Then on the inside, what I did, I actually locked the, the car door and just to, to keep it safe so that nobody will interfere with it and you won't, nobody will be running off with your truck, for instance, because you're leaving it idling. And how long can you leave it idling? Up to eight or 10 hours? Yeah, oh no, actually on, on any car you can run it, any car can run from 50 to 70 hours at idle. Oh my gosh. So in a now, diesel truck this, even longer probably. I know this as a diesel, it's a 250, F250. Yep. So the particulate filter, the DEF filter, yep. uh, they say that don't run it more than 10 or eight hours and then take it out on the road for 15, 20 minutes and it'll clear out that filter and then you bring it back. Exactly right, 100%. Anyway, what's so cool about this, you close this, and then what I will do with my key is lock it, and now it's totally locked. So, I, well, here I can show you. <laughs> well, See, yeah, because... It won't open. <laughs> it would if I touched that one, because I got the key in my hand. But if you're away and you don't, someone has the key, you're all good. So. That's right. Now, now follow, look... me, follow me around the trailer. I just got this all done, at the, redone at the factory. I have this um, 50 amp trailer here with a 30 amp adapter cord and I have a plug a 220 uh, a 30 amp to a 20 amp plug that's an adapter that's easily purchased at any camping world or any any electronic store and so it's plugged right into the trailer and I'm getting maximum power I'm getting up to a thousand watts to run everything and also charge my batteries inside yeah. so this is an ideal solution for boondocking for dry camping and I find myself in that situation. I was at Picacho Peak a couple of years ago, and it got down to 37 degrees. And I wish I had this thing, because I could turn my Aldi system on, propane, and the 1,000 watts would give it enough power that I would have heat inside the trailer. So it's a very convenient thing. They make them in different sizes. My alternator in my truck is only 220, which is su su substantial. But so I had to get the 1,000 uh, watt uh, generator. If I had more or a double alternator, then I would go up probably to a 1500 or actually, you actually make a 3000, don't a you? A 2000 and a 3000. A 2000 if you've got, and a 3000. <laughs> if, you have, if you have dual alternators, you can go with a 3000. That so. is so cool. Yeah. Anyway, it, I just unplugged my shore power. To, so Jonathan showed me how to make this thing work and I am very impressed. It's really cool. Thank I you. can't wait to try it <laughs> on the road. John! <laughs> That's awesome. That's, I love it. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, another happy customer coming another. to you from Airstream. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, over and out.